This video is all about small apartment ideas. So I have done a few things in my apartment that have made my apartment look bigger and just some easy like decorating hacks and things that just honestly make the apartment look a lot bigger and a lot more functional. So I am going to show you all of these small apartment ideas that you can use in your own apartment. I'm Sophia Lee. I'm a recent college graduate who is obsessed with turning her first apartment into a home. I'm taking you along with me and showing you my best decorating ideas, organization tips, and cleaning hacks so that you can make your apartment look Pinterest perfect while sticking to a budget. I'm here to help you turn your apartment into a place you will love. The first small apartment idea that I have used all over my apartment is to use mirrors. And mirrors just give the illusion that your space is a lot bigger. So I've used a mirror right here. I have a full length mirror in my bedroom, which really widens up the space. And then I have a full length mirror in my entryway. And these just kind of all play into each other and just make the space look a lot bigger than it actually is. The second small apartment idea I have for you is to use multi-use furniture. And in my bedroom, I have these two nightstands and I also understand that like some apartments won't be able to fit this big of a nightstand, but if you can get a nightstand that has drawers, you can use, this, use them almost as a dresser. So for like me, I use my nightstand as a dresser and I have my clothes all lined up here, which then eliminates the need for an actual dresser in my bedroom which would take up a lot of space so my closet I have all my hanging stuff and then in my nightstands I have all the stuff that like belongs in a dresser. The third thing that I've done in my apartment to utilize every single space is I've organized a lot of areas and I'm like kind of an organization freak so I really experimented with a lot of different organization containers and stuff and by far the ones that get the most use and like hold the most amount of things are these turntables so like under my kitchen sink i have two of them and they just hold honestly this was kind of filled with random stuff but they just hold a lot more things and then i can get rid of the containers which the containers take up a lot of space so then like over here I have my dishwashing pods and then some more magic erasers and um, I also have like my other cleaning stuff in here. So instead of just having this space right here as like a catch-all area, I have it really organized and I can see everything and then I don't buy extra products because I know exactly what I have. And then this is just another random thing that I just realized, but use your cabinet like sides. Like here I have this dishwasher holder and I hold my like dishwasher stopper and stuff in it and then dish cloth or what are these called? Dish uh, hand things, <laughs> I don't know what they're called. But I just really try to utilize like every single space while keeping it really organized. And to wrap this all up, what I was really trying to get to is get these turntables. I like the ones with the dividers. They are awesome. Number four for small apartment ideas is to utilize every single inch of your space. So I am in my living room right now and then if you come over here, you can see how I have like four feet next to the fireplace and I ended up using this space, one to, to like decorate it so it looks really cute, but then also I added extra seating right here and storage below it, which is just like, this could have been completely wasted space that I did nothing with. So not only did I make it cute, but I also made it really practical. So just go around your apartment and find like little awkward divots and use that to your advantage. Number five, we're still in my living room and that is to go vertical with your space. So I'm lucky and my ceilings are really tall in my apartment, which does a great job at making the space feel bigger in itself. But a little tip for you to make your space feel bigger, especially if your ceilings are shorter, is to go vertical with your artwork and bring it up so then not, people are, their eyes are like going up the wall instead of around, which just makes it feel bigger and more spacious. So for like me, I stacked these three picture frames and I just got these at Michael's for six dollars so they were really inexpensive and then I have that light from Ikea which was like twenty dollars and I did gold rub and buff on it and then I made that canvas so those are just little things that bring the eye up and I have a whole video on how I did all that if you're interested but just go vertical with your artwork and your room will seem a lot bigger 
The next small apartment idea, well, I guess it, it's kind of a small apartment idea. It's more just common sense, but be smart with the furniture pieces you're buying. Like, for example, I just, this is one of my most recent <laughs> furniture pieces, and it's dusty right now, but behind my couch, I had just this space, and one, I didn't like the couch showing, but um, this gives me a lot of extra storage because I got this council table, entryway table, whatever, with that could fit baskets underneath. So I can fill those baskets up and I can put drawers in here or put stuff in there. Or like there's a lot of entryway tables that just don't have any storage in it, which probably wouldn't have been the smartest thing to buy for this area because I wanted places to put things in. So just kind of think about that. I also know that there's like beds that have um, drawers in them that you can pull out, which is really smart. Coffee tables with a lot of storage, just things like that that kind of utilize as much storage space as possible. Small apartment idea, number seven, number eight. I don't know what we're on, but that is to go floor to ceiling with your curtains. And this is the same thing with like going vertical. It will bring your eye up and will just make your ceilings feel taller. It'll make your room feel bigger and it just makes it look overall better. So my rule of thumb is that I hang the curtains two to three inches below the top of the ceiling and then I like the curtains to go all the way to the ground to like touch the ground and I'm extra and like I sewed the bottom of those honestly I did like a really horrible job at sewing the bottom of these you could be a lot more precise but then it just gives it a lot more like custom look but yeah go floor to ceiling with your curtains it will just make it look so much one, it will make it look more polished, but it will also just make it look your room look a lot bigger. So this next thing is like a huge common mistake that a lot of people make. And it's that people buy way too small of rugs for their room. So for living rooms, you usually want bigger than an 8x10. And then for bedrooms, for a queen bed, you also want bigger or usually you want an 8x10 rug and I know like I get almost all my rugs from Rugs USA and they have like strange measurements. It's usually not standard size rugs. So what I do is you want eight inches on the side, at least eight inches on the side from your bed out. This one is like a lot more than eight inches, but at least eight inches. And then in your living room on the edge of your couch, like your couch leg, you want at least six inches and that will make your room feel a lot bigger. A smaller rug will just make everything feel smaller and a big rug kind of opens it up and it just looks, it just looks cuter. And the last small apartment idea that I have for you is actually something that I haven't done, but this is a really good idea for a super small apartment and that is to use acrylic furniture. So use like the furniture that's clear. That way it doesn't block your eye. You can see completely through it and they come in so many different types of furniture. Like there are beautiful coffee tables that are acrylic. There are um, bar stools. You could get a nightstand that's acrylic. Then the nightstand probably wouldn't have um, storage in it, but there's so many places that you could get acrylic furniture and it will just completely open up your space and make it feel a lot bigger. That wraps up this video on small apartment ideas. And obviously there are like thousands of apartment ideas you could go off of, but these are the ones that I personally use in my apartment and find to be the cutest while also being like super practical. And they just work really, really well for me and you can go replicate them in your own apartment. For more apartment decorating ideas, organization tips and cleaning hacks, follow me on Instagram at bysophialee and subscribe to my channel.